Skibbity toilets have all but wiped out the Alliance, and the war is nearly lost. These new models of dark toilets have come out of nowhere. They're more powerful, stealthier, and far, far more ferocious. And they all swear undying loyalty to their leader, the Dark Titan. <laughs> Go forth, men. Crush the Alliance. Obey me and achieve glory. Stupidly, stupidly, stupidly. <laughs> no one can stop me now. Are you sure about that? Right on schedule. Stop. What? <laughs> Take this. <laughs> so predictable. You Titans are all the same. Do not worry. The rest will be joining you soon. Even if you kill me, the Alliance will never die. We'll see. Let this be a warning to any remaining member of the so-called Alliance. The Titans will fall, one by one, until only I, the Dark Titan, remains. Skibbities, march forth, flush out any survivors! missed our train. Then we fight. Now's our chance. <laughs> oh, mind the gap next time, guys. Up, up, move it. to the rest of the Titans. <laughs> Okay, we're a few clicks from Titan Speaker Man's location, which means we need to come up with a plan before we get there. If only knew more about where he came from, we might be able to figure out a way to stop him. I actually might know something about that. You see, while he is a Titan now, he wasn't always one. His father was a TV man, and his mother a camera woman. He was seen as something of an anomaly among the other Alliance members at the time. His father passed away at a young age, so it was left to his mother to parent the boy by herself. Anywhere they'd go, people would speak in hushed whispers behind their backs. The words freak and abomination were heard often by the child. His mother didn't know what to do, and she wasn't always around. The bullying was relentless. In a sort of sick trial, another boy was going to give the child the ultimate swirly. The child had a miserable time at school, and he brought that hurt, pain, and anger back home with him. Make any new friends at school? No. Everyone's mean to me just because I'm different. They think they're so big. Well, I wish the Skibbity Toilets would kill every last one of them. Skibbity! This way! Keep running! Whoa! Awesome! Huh? Ah! Ah! Titan! Please! Can you help? Oh. I'm sorry, Mom! <laughs> <laughs> She's gone. I'm all alone now. The Titan, he, he let her die. With both of his parents now gone, he had nowhere left to turn. And so the child stayed with the Skibbity Toilets, learning the skills necessary to eventually use against his own kind, the ones who made his life miserable. 
For years, he watched his new brethren endure loss after loss at the hands of the Titans. His hatred grew stronger, but he wasn't powerful enough to take them on himself. He realized that the only way to defeat the Titans was to become a Titan. And I helped him. He said he was interested in joining the Titan program. When I saw his face, I couldn't help but be intrigued by the possibilities of making a Titan that had both camera and TV components. I knew a being like him would require three Titan cores. I set them in place and hooked him in. I can still hear his screams, but behind them was joy, a sort of mad bliss that I didn't understand. So I checked his memory logs, and that's when I saw his true intentions. But by that point, it was too late. It's all my fault. TV woman, come in. The Dark Titan, he's here. He... No! Oh, they must have been tracking us. We can point fingers later. For now, the story gave me an idea. Hop on. I'll tell you the plan along the way. Give in! You cannot defeat me! We're not out of this yet. Go, Titan Radio Man. I know that move all too well! <laughs> Say goodbye! What the? Dark Titan! You! What do you want? If you do this, you'll be no better than everyone who bullied you, picking on people smaller than you! <sighs> Take your anger out on the ones who are really responsible for your parents' deaths! Remember back to your past. Before you were taken in by the Skibbities. Your parents loved you. You were a good kid. This war has taken its toll on all of us. And it was wrong what happened to your family. You don't need to add to the bloodshed. It's not what they would want for you. Don't you realize that? Perhaps you're right. Radio Man! What? No! I thought you learned your lesson! I did! That Titan's carelessness killed my mother! For that, he had to die! And now, I will wipe out the rest of the Titans and the Alliance along with them! Looking for me? This is over! We'll meet again! <laughs>